welcome to my channel in this video we are going to discuss about the uh, voltage to current converters the so part one a physical quantity like a temperature pressure motion may have to sense and the sensor will give the voltage based on the physical quantity now this will be processed or will be displayed somewhere and if the distance is more the voltage when it reaches the processing unit or display unit it will be reduced or sometimes because of noise the voltage what is sent what is received will be different so therefore voltage is converted into current so instead of sending a voltage from this point up to the processing or a displaying unit the voltage is converted into current because when we convert into current the noise effect will be very less neither the current will be reduced always the current will remain same in a conductor now we are going to discuss about a voltage to current converter there are two methods are there in this part one we are going to talk about a with floating load and second part we'll discuss about a with a grounded load floating load means load is not connected to the ground and input is given to the non inverting terminal of the operational amplifier feedback voltage across the r1 will drive the inverting terminal and the circuit is also called as series negative feedback amplifier let us write a kirchhoff voltage equation for the input loop what we get v in equal to vid plus vf why now because this is a v in, this is a vid this is a vf once loop vid equal to 0 reason is a is very very large for the operational amplifier Hence, we can rewrite V in equal to Vf. And Vf equal to what? I0 into R1. That is a V in equal to R1 into I0. Or I can say I0 equal to V in divided by R1. We know I0 equal to V in divided by R1. This means the input voltage appears across the R1. Whatever you are applying here, the same voltage will come across the R1. Then I0 can be fixed. I0 equal to V divided by R1. V to I converter can be used in uh, low voltage DC and DC voltmeters, diode match finder, LEDs and Gina diode as well as uh, different uh, diode testers also. References Ramakant Gayakwad and remaining information is covered in the part 2. For more information you can visit these links. Thanks for watching this video. Share this video if you like and subscribe this channel. Thank you.